In this video I want to take you quickly through the WordPress control panel and here I am at the control panel of my website. You can see there's the name of the website up here buildingwordpresswebsites.com It's split generally into three uh, panes. This is the important one and this is the one I want to take you through. This is where you do all your settings. You create pages, uh, add themes, change themes, etc. And these two center panes are mainly information. You can see here I've got 17 posts, 31 pages. I'm running WordPress 381 and I'm using the 2012 child theme. You can change what appears here under the screen options there. Okay, but I'm not going to cover that. I'm going to cover this left hand side here. Now what you actually see here does depend on uh, the plugins you have installed. So some of these options here won't necessarily appear on your installation. It depends what plugins you've installed. But they all work the same same way. So if I put my mouse over here, you can see it changes into a hand and I can have another menu appearing on the right hand side. So on posts, exactly the same thing appears here. So this is where you come to to create new posts and manage existing posts. This is where you come to manage uh, pages, where you add pages. Uh, this one here, Mail Poet, is actually a plugin. Uh, appearance is a very important one. This is where you come to manage themes, where you manage widgets, and where you manage uh, menus. And if you want to change your header image, this is where you come here. And plugins, if you want to install new plugins or manage existing plugins, you come here. You notice the orange circle with the number 7. This means I've got 7 updates waiting. I need to go to the install plugins and update those. Now you might also notice that here I've got a option here, FS Contact Form. This is actually a plugin. So some plugins actually um, install an option uh, underneath the plugins. Some install an option underneath the tools. Some install install an option underneath the settings. So you can see here the settings I can see these are all plugins and some install uh, a brand new option in the left hand bar. bar. This is a, an, again a plugin. It depends on the plugin. The, there doesn't appear to be a standard way of, of managing them. They do one or the other. They install a separate option here in the left hand menu or they install something underneath the settings, uh, the tools or the plugins itself. Okay, so there's the plugins, there's the user where I create new users, tools, uh, main ones here, import, export, and then again these two redirection and broken links are plugins, and settings, this is very important, uh, and this is the, the main area when you've actually just installed uh, WordPress, this is where you configure it either to be a blog or to be a website and a blog. Um, which is where you configure your permalinks so you've actually got nice looking looking links and search engine friendly links and the main options you'll find in the general writing reading and and permalinks but those are actually covered in the blueprint section uh, as part of the install install and setup so just a quick summary um, the left hand side of the control panel is where you you need to concentrate and where you need to get familiar with. So I suggest that you go to your install and just take a look down this left hand side and look at all the options you have available and do remember that you may not see all the options you're seeing in this video because uh, you don't have all those uh, plugins installed and also remember when you do install plugins then to configure that plugin to set up that plugin you'll need to come over here and find out where it actually installs the the settings options and I say usually they're under the plugins themselves, they're under the tools or they're under the settings or some of them install a, br a brand new option right under the main menu as this Pulse plugin has done there. Okay that's a quick overview of the WordPress control panel until next time bye.